Well, it's uh, Super Rugby semi-finals weekend. The Highlanders are in South Africa, of course, and Tyrone Wellington, the Hurricanes v the Chiefs. Oh, what a game. Uh, rugby reporter Joe Porter asked the Hurricanes winger, Corey Jane, whether Dane Coles, the inspirational hooker, will make his return this weekend. Oh, hopefully he plays. Um, he was out here training with us for a bit today, so, um, yeah, hopefully he plays. I mean, he's our, he's our captain. He's a hell of a player too, so... Um, now, if he doesn't play, it'll be a miss, but we've had guys that have filled a spot already this year, so um, we'll see what happens. That's been one of the hallmarks of the team this year, is that whoever does miss out on a spot, whoever takes their place, has really stepped up. You look at the midfield, losing guys like Ma and Conrad last year, and there's been a real rotation this year, but everyone's played really well. Yeah, but I think it's the, it's the same with every New Zealand team this year. Um, you look at the Chiefs, they, you know, they change their team a lot, um, whether it's injuries or just rotating people, and it's looks like they never skip a beat and the Highlanders do the same kind of thing so I think it, depth um, you know, is, is, is good in New Zealand rugby at the moment so um, it's important that if you lose somebody someone comes in and looks like nothing's changed. This match is, is pretty big, the Chiefs scraped past you last time, what's the key to beating them and getting on the right side of the ledger this time round? Yeah I mean oh, last time they, um, you know, they ripped us apart, uh, defensively we let in a, a few easier tries um, and, and they got some great attacking um, players that can beat you one on one, but when they get it right as a team, they can also beat you that way. So now we need to be smart. We need to uh, put pressure on them, make our tackles, and swip it around when we got the ball. You know, we need to take take our opportunities because you know they're a tough team and they're going to be there the whole game as well. So it's important that we start from minute one and, and we do the job. And being able to prepare at home in Wellington ahead of this crunch game, that must be an advantage. A dollar each way. Um, you know, it, it's good being home and, and not having to travel, but then. You know, you've got the kids at home that really don't let me rest or, or sleep, where if you went and travelled, you probably get an afternoon nap in somewhere. So, um, a dollar each way. And you're getting even less sleep at the moment. The kids are a bit crook. Yeah, kids have got um, chicken pox. So, um, you know, not happy, happy campers at the moment. So, uh, it'll be good when that phase goes. Corey is a born and bred Wellingtonian who spent his career with the Hurricanes. How much would winning a maiden super title for them be? And how much would it mean to you? Oh, I mean, the, I mean the world really. Um, you know, I've been here for a while now, and uh, it hasn't really been until the last uh, year or two that me being part of the Hurricanes that I really believe you know, we can win it. I think in past, you know, we've we've had the skill to go on and.